Funny how the day just makes it feel like you're right here. I never thought I'd be the one to say. But I can feel your presence with me, though you're not around. I'm carrying you with me anyway. So it's a little bit after nine right now. And I thought that my occupational therapist was coming at nine, but she's actually coming at 10. So that's fun. Hey everybody. So today is, oh, I can't believe today is Monday already. I feel like the days just fly by. But today is week three, day one of um, rehabilitation. Um, and I just finished my OT session. She just left and we did more, like we just practiced like walking in the bathroom, turning and sitting on the toilet and getting back up and moving. Um, and so we, uh, and then I'm just, was telling her how my energy is just gone. So I'm getting my baseline back or whatever, but I mean, not really because my left leg is still having trouble moving. Um, it's almost like my brain just like isn't back there yet or something happened. I don't know. I go see my doctor on Thursday, so I'll talk to him about that. But, um... If any of you have any tips for getting your energy back, let me know, because I am exhausted, like, literally exhausted. Um, and um, the only thing left I have to do today is I have to go to my horse lesson, which I haven't been able to do, like, literally since it started. It started, like, March 13th, and I literally... Haven't been able to go, um, but I'm hoping that's a bucket filler rather than a bucket drainer, you know? Um, but anyway. I think we better make sure we start, like, getting ready, like, an hour ahead of time, even though it's 10 to the hill. To the horse? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm just going to go like this. I wasn't. Yeah, we might need something warm on your feet if it doesn't get cooler. Anyways. You probably should call them and make sure. No, I, she just texted me back just now. I gotta look. Who? The farm? Yeah. Oh. What? So why did you text me? But yeah, so I'm getting my strength back. Um, other than obviously that left leg, but we think that it's just taking a while to come back, um, which is fine. I mean, not really fine, because it was my dominant side, but whatever. Um, I mean, it's fine. Like, I'm healthy. I'm out of the hospital. So, or I'm getting healthier. I'm out of the hospital. So, but yeah. Any tips for getting your energy back? Please let me know in the comments below. So, hey, everybody. It is 2.15 right now. And I'm still incredibly exhausted. However, um, I'm going to see my horse lesson, which I haven't been able to do in like a month. Um, I'm going to the horse lesson. Uh, number one, it's good for me to get outside. Number two, horses, um, like dogs, you know, like dogs and really any animal, horses have been there to help me with a lot of issues, uh, whether it be anxiety, whether it be depression, whether it be grief, whether it be, you know, just, um, and these, like, I'm not going there for like, oh, this is mental health therapy or, oh, this is whatever. I'm literally going there to just take care of the horse and like groom her and pet her and you know 
run her around a little bit. Although, I'm probably not going to do that because I'm still a little sore. However, um, which that's a whole other story that I'll get into later. Um, however, uh, by me taking care of her, she's also helping to take care of me. It's like a give and take kind of thing. Like anything in life really is, but it's definitely a give and take kind of thing. Hey everybody, it is a little after three right now. Um, and I'm just getting home because the place is like a few minutes from my house. It's, re it's literally in, in my freaking red shit. light. Sorry. No, you're fine. I blew right through that red light like it was um, not even that red stop sign didn't even exist. Well, that's why I don't want to play with the kids outside because people drive crazy on this road. Well, anyways, so, um, it's really nice that we don't have to go far for that kind of thing. But anyways, I'm just incredibly exhausted. Like, um, she, my teacher even asked me, she was like, well, do you want to, like, move them around a little bit? And I was like, honestly, I don't even feel up to doing that. I'm so tired. So I just kind of brushed her and we just kind of hung out because I was, I'm like exhausted. So that's what I said. I said just being in this calming environment is more than enough. And also like, I mean, not that like I haven't gotten out of the house, but like, like getting out of the house and like, being social with people at all it all adds up and it's all important you know hey everybody so the thing i wanted to tell you guys is um i ordered these shoes from billy footwear um man that needs to be stirred if you guys are in the, uh, that needs to be stirred. If you guys are in the, um, like Instagram disabled community, I think you've heard of them, but they're the shoes that have the zippers on them. Well, let's just say I'm not impressed because I ordered a pair of sneakers and usually I don't talk about money on my channel, but these were 90 dollars like including shipping and everything still but the the tag came out to ninety dollars and i ordered them like maybe a day or so after my uh therapy started now we're going into week three and and i had emailed them and i said hey like i'm you know using them for rehab to get stronger like you know, they came highly favored to me, blah, 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 blah. And they said, they said, oh, um, you know, we, we had a big sale or whatever, so we're getting to it. And I get it, right? Like, I understand, but like, I'm just like, oh my God, seriously. I don't know, it's, just, it's annoying because like when, people like hype up something which I understand because like I've done it too but I'm like really this isn't even that good but whatever they say they'll be here April 9th which is like when my therapy ends but whatever I need good gym shoes for like the gym or not the gym but like my bike and stuff and Peloton so we'll see but anyway I'm gonna drink my decaf coffee and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Love you guys. Bye.